And we move next here tonight to the Gulf Coast and neighbors there returning home to find their homes in ruins. And tonight our Anthony Hill taking you to Indian Shores at a 75 year old hotel that took a gut punch from Helene. This is the Sunburst Inn. It's nestled between Gulf Boulevard and the beach here in Indian Shores, and it suffered severe damage during Hurricane Helene on Thursday. This is also the place where I covered Hurricane Adalia a year ago. This is a special edition of ABC Action News. This is video I shot last year of the Sunburst Inn. However, this time around, the 75-year-old hotel was severely damaged. And I don't think I fully realized the impact until I got here and I was able to see everything and, and realize it's, it's so much bigger than scooping out sand and replacing drywall. I just, I don't even know if we'll be able to, to fix the damage. Andy Diamond has owned the Sunburst Inn for eight years. You can come in, just be careful. She gives me a tour of the damage. Part of what makes me the most sad because this is our office and this is where people's vacations started. This is where they're welcomed by our amazing team. This is where their journey with us would begin. And you can see right here that the water obviously went up to about two and a half feet which means this entire office was basically a fishbowl. The entire first floor of her hotel is destroyed and submerged in sand. If you reach up, you can see now that you can touch the ceiling because the level of sand is so impacted and so high that it's about three feet up and you can actually touch the ceiling now. Andy tells me she fears she may have to have the place demolished. This just a year after it was renovated on HGTV's 100 Day Dream Home. In Indian Shores, I'm Anthony Hill, ABC Action News.